Is the owner of Geno's here? Where is he? How you doing? No, Mike, how you? Uh, let me tell you something about this. Is my hero over here. So, how are you? I'm doing great, Sean. Okay. One great American to another. You are a great American. Take your hand. I think he has a thing to, or two to say about like immigration law and a bunch of other things. Well, you know how I feel about illegals. I just want you to come here like our grandparents and people before them. They play by the rules. That's all we're asking. See, everybody. Yeah. They want. I've been in Arizona. I've been on the border. I've talked to the ranchers out there. I've seen the the trails with the human waste and debris. It's terrible out there. And that governor, she's got a lot of. You know what? I mean, <laughs> she's she's my kind of lady. I, I, I think I think the word is cojones. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Right. I talked to the state representative, Russell Pierce, who initiated the immigration bill. There's, there's nothing racial about that profile. What people seem to forget, illegal is not a race. Illegal is a crime. And Can I ask a question? <laughs> Have you thought about running for president? <laughs> To be perfectly honest, you know what happened to a guy like me? See, I deal in reality. It's one thing. You might not like my policies, but you'll get the truth. And if I was to run for any office, they would call me up in the hill and put a... They would put a... Mayor, behind my right? They don't want the truth. I mean, we have an administration. You know what? You want to talk about gangsters. They make the mafia look like altar boys. <laughs> they're, they just, they're destroying our kids' future. I mean, just imagine, you want to get out of debt with you. He's got a filter on right go now. Buy a, go, go borrow another 10000 That's how you get out of debt. Where is that playing at? And as far as Arizona, we got to support Arizona. Because we right now, we're all Arizonans. We what we have to stop is what's playing in that movie theater. If we don't stop it, we'll be playing in our movie theater. And I don't want that. So we got to stop it down that track. And Joe Apaya, that shirt, you got to love this guy. Mm -hmm. Here's a guy. Yeah. I've been to Tent City. I met with him one on one. We did a show together. This guy is a great, great guy. This is, a, this is what be in Philadelphia. He would be our Frank Rizzo. <laughs> okay. He just says it like it is. If you disagree with his policies, you don't like his tent city, he's got a very simple solution. Don't do no crime in my town. Because this is one sheriff that's going to enforce the law. I understand there are some sheriffs out there that refuse to enforce the law. They should be fired. Your job is to enforce the law regardless. You can't select any force. You want to give amnesty? I think that's the next thing to talk not about. Not me. Don't look at me. No, no, well, <laughs> it's got to be your president because he's not my president. By the way, you mentioned Sheriff Arpaio. Right. They, don't, they don't have Gino's cheesesteaks. They get a, a 25-cent bologna sandwich. Yeah, well, I got you some good cheesesteaks back here waiting for you. Oh, wait. you're the man. Yeah, you got it. Oh, you got it back you. in. You got him out there. No problem. Sean, I guess you know. Thank, thank you for coming. Yeah. Uh, yeah. If I was John Kerry, I'd ask for Swiss cheese on mine. I think we found your new mayor right there. <laughs> 